Hello, back into our 10 count combos from the curriculum. Uh, this one we're going off of the basic four counts, so jab straight, hook straight. However, we're gonna play that with some different variations. So a lot of times we play, we're all on one elevation. Sometimes we're changing that up or we're going low, high, low, or high, low, high, or low, low, high, kind of mixing up the variables. So a couple ideas off of this, and in each time we're following up off of with the left kick. And if you watch the last few videos, we showed you different ways that you can enter off of that left kick. Go back and watch those if you haven't already, and you'll see some different ways that you can apply that here at the end of this combo. So the way this is gonna look is off of the basic four count, we could go one, two, three, four, all high elevation. He follows up with that left kick. I might have the, the jab come low, the straight high, the hook low, high. So on that one, I'm going low, high, low, high. Or I might just go low, high, 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 and high. Or high, low, high, high, and high. So you can mix that up on your fighter to create some different opportunities. Now, also, um, something you can do here, which is very important in any kind of drills that you're doing, is getting the fighter to feel the distance. And so as we're playing, sometimes I might hold for the jab here and then bring the right here, and then he finishes off and goes with the combination. Or I might press him back, press him back, all the way so he's, he's retreating in the combination. Or I might make him retreat a little bit and then come back in. Ah, ah. So you're working that distance, and as he gets better at reading that and feeling that, he's always gonna be mirroring me and being in the perfect range to come in for attack and that's something you wanna do. And it's good to do this with a simple combination like this and get the repetitions and just kind of work on that one skill. Because if you start trying to throw too many things out there, sometimes he really never polishes anything. So we look at that and work on maybe that distancing skill. And then of course he's got all the variations of the different styles of kicks he can be throwing, the different elevations with the hands and all that. So uh this is basic off of the uh number four variation in uh the current curriculum so thanks for watching and uh stay tuned for the next one we'll see you soon